Hello, I'm Lori Vick from University Hospitals and welcome to The Health Difference. Parkinson's disease can rob a person of the ability to do things that we all take for granted. When medications stop easing the tremors, the experts at University Hospitals Neurological Institute offer hope. The worst part was I had severe nightmares. Uh, this big snake was chasing me across the earth all the time. After 14 years of battling the effects of Parkinson's disease, Jim Atkinson was reaching his limit. His medications were causing nightmares and other life-disrupting side effects, and his tremors were getting worse. If I was going to be safe around the home, I was probably going to be bound to a wheelchair before very long. You might feel the tingling. Dr. Benjamin Walter, the medical director of the Deep Brain Stimulation Program at University Hospital's Neurological Institute, had an option for Jim, one that would give him back his independence. DBS is a pacemaker technology for the brain. It's deep brain stimulation. Patients who opt for DBS have a pacemaker placed in the chest. Then a surgeon implants wires through a hole in the skull about the size of a dime. When the DBS is activated, the pacemaker sends electric signals to the diseased area of the brain. Essentially, it's uh, disrupting a disruptive signal within the brain and allowing the rest of the brain to function more normally. And for someone like Jim, who is fighting to live a self-sufficient life, the DBS made all the difference. My arms and my legs just fully relaxed for the first time in 14 years. What a feeling. <laughs> for more information or to get a doctor referral, call 866-UH4-CARE anytime, night or day, or visit our website. Because at University Hospitals, our doctors make the difference.